Hello, I am your teacher, Gary Vernier. Welcome to Activate Your Grammar. Today, you are going to learn how to use the present continuous in affirmative sentences in English. Let's begin with what you already know, the present continuous in Spanish. In Spanish, to form a sentence in the present continuous, you use this formula, subject plus estar plus the verb, ending in ando or yendo. Here are some examples. Ella está hablando. El niño está comiendo. Nosotros estamos estudiando. In English, it is just as easy to form a sentence in the present continuous tense. You follow the exact same formula as you do in Spanish. Subject plus the verb be plus the main verb ending in ing. Let me repeat. You use the exact same formula as you do in Spanish. Here are some examples. Spanish. Ella está hablando. English. She is speaking. Spanish. Ellos están estudiando. English. They are studying. The video will now stop and you will have an activity to identify verbs in the present continuous tense in affirmative sentences. Okay, there are two very important rules you must remember when speaking in the present continuous. Rule number one, if the subject is he, she, or it, the verb be changes to is. If the subject is they, we, or you, the verb be changes to are. If the subject is I, the verb be changes to am. So just like in Spanish, the verb be changes depending on the subject. Here are some examples. Spanish, el tigre está corriendo. English, the tiger is running. Spanish, los hermanos están jugando. English, the brothers are playing. Spanish, yo estoy cocinando. English, I am cooking. Very good. Now, let's look at rule number two. In English, you must always say the subject. In Spanish, you do not need to say the subject. Here are some examples. Spanish, estoy hablando. English, I am speaking. Did you notice that in Spanish, you only have to say estoy, but in English, you have to say I am. The word está in Spanish does not mean is. It means he is, she is, or it is, based on the context. Estoy equals I am. Está equals he, she, or it. Estamos equals we are, and están equals they are. So remember, you must always say the subject when using the verb be in present continuous sentences. The video will now stop and you will have an activity to form the present continuous in affirmative sentences. Congratulations! Now you know how to form affirmative sentences in the present continuous. I will see you back here again for the next lesson. Good luck.